hello guys please welcome today we are going to be fixing any challenge that you have anytime you try to upload song or any music onto garage band so very quickly anytime you try to upload any song onto garage band and it comes out this way what it means is that it's not supported and cannot be used as a ringtone or cannot be transported from this particular page onto the page where you can actually use it as a ringtone so right here it is not active if your issue is the same what you have to do is to move on to the app store and then you are going to get this particular app it is file converter this particular one is actually the one i recommend you go and then get it installed open it up very quickly and this is how the interface looks like what you are going to do is you are going to convert that particular mp3 into another form of file which is wave file or wav files and this one can actually be able to be transported onto your garage band so very quickly you are going to click onto this particular option and you are going to bring in the file or the song from the file session uh, very quickly so once i've come here i'm going onto the browse folder where i've actually got the music i would like to change which is currently at the download section uh, right here i'm going to bring in this particular music and it is the mp3 file and right here i am converting from the mp3 to the wave file very quickly go ahead and tap the conversion very quickly and as you can see the conversion has been successful what you need to do is to go ahead and tap onto this particular share button very quickly you are going to save file and once this particular option opens up make sure you tap onto my iphone this way and it's going to bring out garage band for ios tap on it and then go ahead and click on to or you can tap on it again and then click on to save now that has been shared or saved onto the garage band so very quickly if i go back onto the garage band and i open it up i can actually be able to find that particular music that i've set in being shown so right here you are going to move files or allow files to be moved onto the garage band very quickly all right so as you can see the file has come in so from here you can actually be able to drag it or move it straight onto the garage band so basically that is how it is thank you so much if this particular video has been very helpful to you then please go ahead and subscribe to my channel for more lessons like this in the coming days as i will be coming your way again with another exciting piece of content please have a great day